Increasing the number of female leaders in the Pacific was the focus of a three-day forum held in Auckland this week. The Pacific Women in Power Forum brought together members of parliaments, ministers, governors and parliamentary staff from 11 countries in the region. Tiana Haxton was at the forum and filed this report. Less than 7% of elected members of parliament across the Pacific are women. The Women in Power Forum brought the 7% together to network and discuss ways to increase this figure. Hosted by the UNDP, the forum aims to encourage the region's female leaders to stand strong in tough political environments and inspire the next generation. The UNDP's Tuya Alton Garrel says the gathering provides a safe space for members to speak up about their collective experiences and challenges. This platform is creating that opportunity to see how we can train and engage and ensure that there is a next generation of women leaders who can participate in the politics, whether it's at the national or subnational levels. Honourable Rhonda Tiaki of Niue was the youngest member in attendance. She wholeheartedly believes that more female representation is needed in Pacific governments. Ms Tiaki says women leaders bring a fresh perspective to the political arena. As women, we think different, we do things differently, and we bring that structure into um, parliaments. But we also have to apply the gender lens in all our work, yeah, just to make sure that everyone is being represented fairly. Bougainville's community minister agrees. The Honourable Theonela Roca says being surrounded by other Pacifica leaders boosted her confidence. She is certain they can all work together to inspire more young women to join politics and change the statistic. Being in the room and sensing all the energy and the drive that the women have, we may be looking forward to bringing a lot more, you know, many female prime ministers and presidents across the Pacific region. And I'm really optimistic about that. Fiji's Linda Tambuya says strong solidarity of Pacific women across the region will make their voices louder. She believes having more women in politics will raise the visibility and viability of women in decision-making spaces. Even though we're small in numbers, we are big in terms of our voice. We are the smallest population in the world. But when women support women and women come together in solidarity, we can make magic and can really affect change in the world. The three-day forum concluded this afternoon. Attendees left with a stronger sense of connection across the region as they worked together towards a collective goal to inspire more women to become political leaders.